Cody Kostecki wants the lead of the race. Jacobson took it off Pitha at turn one. This is Kostecki for the lead. He's got the inside down at turn 11, uses the curb. Oh, it's going to be a squeeze on here. Jerry Jacobson has run so wide deep. Taken. Oh, Pitha runs Pitha wide. On the road. And he'll drop back here a few spots. Kostecki's now up to second as well. This will be a massive oh. win for the crew, and he's going to go for it at turn one, and he moves through on the Arco plate entry. So the Nissan crosses the line first, but your race winner is car 57, second in shot there, the Arco plate entry of Brody Kostecki. And the lights are out. The curve race Brody. of the 500, even start between Brody Kostecki and Paul Dumbrell. Oh, he puts the nose in. Done. Get in there, Brody Kostecki with the drive of a lifetime. Woo! Yes. <laughs> I'm just so thankful to be here, and you know, I like to thank my family, my uncle, for you know giving me such a great opportunity. I just can't believe I'm standing here. Vaughn throws oh, it inside, inside, and he gets him back. Love might get the run on all of them once more. This is fabulous racing in the Dunlop series. Three wow. wide, hold your breath down this back stretch. It is on. Oh, no, 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 no. He's gone around in a big way. Can he keep it off the road? That's a big one down the back stretch. Now, where did this all go wrong? Did Love. Oh. oh. No, Vaughn. Oh, really unlucky there. He's all the way out on the left. We're going to have a look at that one. Very difficult to get away with. Man, that is fast. Really, really fast. And uh, gee, just glad to see that car stayed where it did out there. And it's sliding back onto the road. Who knows where to look? Double yellows. Double yellows in the background. Off, oh, the leader's off. off. They're all off. There's mud everywhere. Charters are around. Oh, oh, my goodness. Big one in the background. There's the more to it. In. They're all in. Look at the mud. There's our championship leader, finds his way through. Crazy moment on the last lap. Oh, what a shame for T-Max as well. Started on the pole today. Yeah, nothing to show for it. Oh, so this is where it put all the mud everywhere. It was Jason Gomes oh. had a massive moment. Up at turns two and three. And then when the field came around, Fiore got caught out. A lot of them got caught out. Charter went around. You'll see a big one in the back where Maxwell, Missouris, and then there's mud everywhere. It is an ice rink. Jack Perkins up in. Oh, it's getting tight in here. Russell takes Across the, the grass. grass. Bang, straight in the wall. Perkett fires in as well. Perkins is involved too. And Chaz Mostert. McLaughlin smashed. This is carnage. Oh, this is terrible. This is a lot of the championship contenders here. Here's the replay, Jack Perkins. Now, McLaughlin lunges, that's okay. Russell takes to the grass, but can't pull it up. It smashes in a wall, uh, and nowhere to go for Jack. He could not see what was going on in there. Jack was that close to McLaughlin. Russell cuts the corner, a lot of mud, can't stop, on slick tyres. David Wall was his brakes in the end. And Perkett's in the same, and I think he tapped Chas Mostert on the way through, but was lucky to escape. This is Rodney Jane's car we're on board with. It all unfolds. Look at this. This is just disaster. Half a dozen cars. Massive damage to Charter's car. Look at the damage to Forward's car. So Charter's body language suggested he was pushed or turned. Is that what he was doing with his hands Yeah, well, with uh, his looks hands like there? Uh, Jack LeBrox had a bit of a word with him there. So Here's Charter, right down the inside, number 18. Comes across, clips him. Marjoram's off the ground. Oh. It just launched off the inside curb. Where's Douglas? How did he miss this? Douglas was so... Oh, massive! Oh, oh, oh. Touch here, moves over, bang. Into Josh Keane. Yep, and that was all over. Oh, that's huge. And how did Tess Douglas get missed? Oh, my God.